Let's start this video with a cold start. Hello guys, you are watching my BMW vlog. My name is Alex and today I will shoot a little video for you how I'm going to debatch my BMW X5M. Recently I installed black trunk lead uh, emblem and I think chrome regular chrome does not go very well with that it's kind of like uh, we have to go either chrome for emblem or black here so you, you you see my point so i just decided to remove it completely because i like how clean my car will look uh, i already debatched several bmws before and never had any issues, never had any residue left. So for this, you will need a heat gun, you will need a dental floss or fishing line, and just patience and you make sure you don't overheat this area because if you do, you may uh, have some issues with your paint. So let's just get to it and just follow my steps or just watch this video. For this, I'm gonna use the cheapest uh, heat gun you can find from um, Harbor Freight Tools. Basically, that's what I got, and it doesn't have much settings, just one and two. So I'm gonna go on one. Just make sure that you don't overheat this area too much, as I said before. Next step is just to use a dental floss and we're gonna try to remove our badging. Never use pry tools or like screwdrivers because you will damage the paint. See, if it's warm enough, it just goes like a knife through butter. So easy, super easy. Next, I'm gonna have to remove remains of the double-sided tape and make sure we don't see any silhouettes of X5M on a trunk lid. It's almost invisible from this angle, uh, but I will show you the angle right now where you will see silhouette of uh, badging. That's why you need buffing or you need some kind of vaccine to get rid of that silhouette. And I'm almost done cleaning up remains of uh, double-sided tape. Just few spots left over here, but you're probably not gonna see it on the camera because they are super tiny. 
I'm using just a regular microfiber towel uh, with warm water. You can see from this angle, uh, it's because it's wet from water. You can see the X5M right here. So that's why we need to polish this area right here. And for my last step, I will use this uh, synthetic wax. Uh, never used Mother's California Gold before, so we'll see how it's gonna turn out. We'll follow hand use instructions, of course, and we'll see how it's gonna turn out on my car. Okay, this part is done. I just have to wait until there's going to be like a haze. That's how instructions tell me to wax this thing. And then we'll just remove everything with a clean cloth. We'll see the results. Okay, so about 10 minutes passed. I can see it's kind of like white haze so instructions are telling me to just wipe it off and we will see the result After removing this haze, uh, remains of the vaccine, I'm trying to point this light from various angles and I don't see any remains of the badging, no silhouette, no remains of glue or double-sided tape. So I think uh, this um, wax, this synthetic wax did the job. It's called Mother's California Gold it does job perfectly so basically next what i'm going to do i will debatch my 535 and uh, we'll just go from there so thank you guys for watching it if you like this video uh, just make sure you uh, hit the uh, like button if you have any comments uh, make sure you comment below uh, what products you were using when you were debatching your car and also stay tuned i have more videos about my cars next one will be about coding so i will code my uh, x5m to some um, uh, specific codings i would like it to have that they didn't have from factory and i think that gonna be very interesting for people who own bmws and they would like to add some custom features thank you for watching stay tuned and i'll see you next video